Taoyuan Mayor Zheng Wenchan announced yesterday that the Taoyuan Airport MRT would get a fare reduction as early as October 1st, thanks to a tremendous operating surplus. But some observers wonder how the airport MRT is making any money at all. Today, a Taoyuan councillor said that even before operating day, the airport MRT had racked up a loss of 3.6 billion Taiwan dollars due to a constant delays. In response to the skeptics, the airport MRT made its financial records public for the first time in order to prove that it was, in fact, not operating at a loss. Outside Taoyuan International Airport, only a few passengers are waiting at the window to buy coach bus tickets. In contrast, the entrance of the airport MRT system is a hive of activity as passengers move to and fro, dragging their luggage. This sharp contrast is felt especially acutely in the struggling coach bus industry. After the airport metro introduced season tickets and senior discounts this year, ridership has swelled and so has its operating surplus. That's according to Taoyuan Mayor Zheng Wenchan, who announced a fare cut on Monday. A Taoyuan councillor today accused the mayor of cutting prices as an election gambit. The people's suspicions are reasonable, of course. We councillors have requested a fare cut for the airport MRT for a long time. Why announce it now? Why do it now? Cutting the airport MRT's fare in stages and diversifying its services will help boost ridership. In this stage, the price of every journey will be reduced by 10 NT. That's expected to increase ridership by about 8 percent. And that's enough to maintain the revenue. Addressing allegations that it had not posted a profit, Taoyuan's airport MRT made its financial records public for the first time. The records showed operating surplus of 118 million Taiwan dollars in the 2017 fiscal year. From January to June of this year, revenue from fares and other business streams reached 920 million Taiwan dollars. After deducting operating costs of 700 million Taiwan dollars, the airport MRT posted a surplus of 220 million Taiwan dollars in the first half of the year.